It's locked. One hour later. My brothers have escaped you.
hatred shall darken the world no longer. Hey, Meth here, and that was Mephisto in Act 3. One of the coolest looking bosses, I, I think, of the game. Um, so here are my tips, the uh, takeaways, really, for Act 3. Number one, Mephisto is an endurance fight. You can easily dodge his protect projectiles at a distance. Just, you know, walk back and forth, give you time to regenerate life or figure out what to do next. Um, or maybe avoid uh, a couple of the attacks that you don't want to get hit by. I did not like his uh, frost attacks, obviously. Try to stay away from those. Uh, could eat a lightning attack. So, uh, just know you can dodge by moving back and forth at a distance. He'll kind of stay there like a turret and pivot. But he's got a lot of, a lot of health. Uh, it'll take a second to knock him down. Number two, stay out of fire. This is an age-old, you know, tip, but uh, it really matters in this act. These flame-throwing pygmy, pygmies, man. Pygmies are uh, annoying to begin with. They do a lot of damage and can kill you fast, and they're quick themselves. But the flame-throwing ones, you'll die before you know it. So, kind of prioritize them. Stay out of the fire once you see it. Uh, you'll get you'll get used to it. A lot of Act 3 is controlling distances. Number 3. You don't get to keep the flail. Uh, you're going through this whole quest to create this flail. It looks cool, probably in comparison to the weapons that you have. Uh, but all quest weapons that you build or create, as soon as you use them for their quest, go away. You don't get to keep it. Number four, left trigger and select, at least on Xbox, will show you the game in the original graphics. As I understand it, the re uh, the, the resurrected part, right, the new graphics are kind of overlaid over the old ones. And uh, at least here, it was kind of cool to see how they looked uh, originally way back when. Massive difference. So. Find out whatever system you're using on, you know, and, and check that out. It's pretty cool. Finally, number five, there are a lot of locked chests in Mephisto's room. Uh, I really started caring about keys in this area, and I was like, I can't believe I, you know, got rid of <laughs> my key. They're taking up bag space. I'm an idiot, okay? Uh, just keep your keys, and, you know, when you're on those locked chests, you can actually open them instead of walking away disappointed. And that's it. Hope you enjoyed Act 3. I kind of liked it. On to Act 4.